Hey YouTube, it's Mike Penn Gangster here, and today we're going to be reacting on David's Blaine new video of him revealing the secrets to his magic. Now, I've always been fascinated by David Blaine and his magic and the stuff that he does. So, we're going to look into the video, and I'm going to give you guys my opinion on what I think uh, of what he's coming up with, if it's going to be something that's going to be very interesting. I think it's going to be very interesting, but let's go ahead and look at the video. <laughs> People have asked me to teach them magic for years, and I've. One thing I always enjoyed by um, is, is is stuff is his presentation and his voice. The way he uh, announces things, it it gives you that like that hype. You know, he's just he just has that. Never agreed to do that. Magic, I guess. Until now, he knows that for the first time sense. ever. I'm going to share some of my favorite secrets and magic with you. I'm David Blaine, and welcome to my studio. We know who you are. In this class, you're going to learn some of my favorite tricks, magic that I do all the time, all right here. You'll be able to go out. And I just hope he shows us more than just like card tricks, because I kind of want to know like some other stuff that he does. Immediately and blow people's minds anywhere in the world with nothing but a deck of cards. Nah, nah, I, am, I am fascinated with cards because I'm a big Texas Oldham player, so I would love to learn a couple of tricks to win a couple, a little bit of, you know, a couple pots here and there. You, know? you can close your whole set of magic with this trick. Wow. That's the really fun part of magic. The language, it's the psychology. <laughs> I know I'm gonna force a seven of hearts. You know what this is, but they don't know that you know. I can use this method to control what somebody's thinking. Say your card. Nine of clubs. That's wow. It. Take a card, put your hand on top. Yeah, I just took your card out. That's crazy. And look in your hand. I think that's one of the coolest things about card tricks is that it's, it's some of them are, ex are really as simple as they look. Um, so for him to show us some of the ones that look pretty cool like you could really amaze your friends families and stuff like that i mean i'm really uh excited by this beyond card tricks i'll take you even further into my world breath in start the clock harry houdini was a handcuffed king but i know he could not do this okay i'm gonna show you that i I know a lot of people right away are gonna be like, oh, those things were already broken. I really doubt it. I really believe there's physical magic uh, out there. Uh, there's there's people that know some know how to do some crazy shit. I can sew my pulse down, and now I just put a little pressure here, and my pulse stops. So weird, yeah. Keep going. You just pass Tudini. So I squeeze here, then I make an S. <sighs> now you have a deck ripped in half. Five minutes. <laughs> Wow! You just did five minutes. I'm blown away. What can you teach us next? Th that's crazy because learning how to hold your breath is, is something that I've, I've seen many, many times on documentaries of stuff. Like that. I've also watched a documentary of a particular person um, that could stay like over 20 minutes underwater, uh, like keeping their breath. It's just insane. And he did it himself for one of his um, challenges. <laughs> I'm going to introduce you to some of my favorite magicians and you'll see us working on the actual process that I use to develop some of my favorite routines. All right, let me get this straight. We have a classic card, a card stab. stab. Oh. Yep. So it penetrates just up to the card that they're thinking of. So <laughs> good! <laughs> what was your card? Five of hearts. Yeah. Wow! You did it. Ow! Ow! Perfect. Got it. Great. He's using, I, I imagine he's using a real deck. You're probably wondering, why would I do this? Magicians are not supposed to share these guarded secrets. Uh, I think we all know why you're doing this, but I still respect it. Hey, the guy's trying to make money. I respect it. It's entertaining. You do what you gotta do. That's the way I For see For me, it. magic is more than just learning tricks. Magic has opened the door to so many opportunities in my life. 
time. I've met some of the most amazing people. Broken every divide. There's no language barriers. It's helped me learn math, science, performance, public speaking. Magic has the power to do all that. And that's why I want to... And you know what's cool about magic? It brings people together. Especially that we live in this society that there's so much hatred. Magic could bring all cultures together. And everybody kind of like, you know, has a good time. And that's what we need. More Share this with you. Whether you're a magician or not, I think you're going to be very surprised by what you're able to do in just one month of learning magic with me. I'm David Blaine, and welcome to my studio. I like it, man. Like, I mean, look, this is the way I see it. If you could learn, like, even one trick, or even if you don't learn a trick, just watching this, I like it. It all depends if you're somebody that's into magic. I'm into magic. I'm into magic. I'm into, like, these type of stunts that he does, where he does these challenges, you know, like keeping his breath or... Or, or living in in, in, in in the floor, you know, like when he was in, the, in, I think it was in New York. I can't remember where it was. But for me, it's, look, you guys let me know what you guys think. I think this will be a pretty cool show. I think anything that, like, re around David Blaine and, and, and the way he does things is entertaining. So let me know what you guys think. I think this is going to succeed. We'll see what happens. I mean, hey, has he ever not succeeded, you know, so... Let me know if you guys are hyped for uh, this upcoming, uh, I guess, series that he's doing. So, anyways, i see you guys in the next one. Have a good day, guys. Bye-bye.